Hey guys, welcome back, and today guys, I'm going to show you how to create a virtual machine within your Zen Center. Yes, it's time to create a virtual machine. So, I'm still using my Zen Server A for my Zen Center. Uh, you, you, get, you get do it two ways. You just select, you can right click, new virtual machine, or go to the toolbar and go to new virtual machine. So, I'm going to do it, right click, new virtual machine. And as you can see, you get like these. This is uh, by default. This is what Zen Center gives you. They give you all these nice little templates. I, I'm gonna do other install media. Uh, let's give it a name. Uh, you give it a description if you want. Hit next. Now we don't have a DVD, but we want to use our library. And I'm just gonna pick this one. And I'm gonna hit next. Is how much memory I have. Hit next. Uh, let's uh, give it a, a gig. Let's give it some space. Uh, I only got six gigs, so let's uh, do it. Let's give it two. Uh, you can give the virtual disk a name. I'm going to leave it as the default. Hit add. Hit next. You can actually manipulate your networking if you want. I'm going to leave it as the default. Hit next. And if you want to start the virtual machine automatically, leave this checked off and create now. So at the bottom right here, it says provisioning the VM, creating the CD drive. It's doing everything that it needs. Pretty soon, you're going to see your, your new virtual machine show up right here. Awesome. And it's green. It's beautiful. So let's click on it. Let's go to console. And there it goes. Uh, it started up. Pick your option that you want. You can start installing your operating system or your uh, configure your new virtual machine within your Zen Center. So that's pretty cool. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them right below at the comment section. Please give me likes and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.